delicious homemade frica filled with potatoes and cheese. It's sure to hit the spot every time. Welcome to my sleeping room kitchen and here's another dish. You're going to need three potatoes, um, extra old hard cheese, bacon, parsley or chives, and salt and pepper. If you have a mandolin, use a mandolin. If not, just an ordinary grater or cut them really thin. What you want is nice thin slices like this. So once the potatoes are grated, put in the water to soak. I usually soak them about 20 minutes. Traditionally, we would use Talman's cheese, which comes from the Socha Valley in Slovenia, which has an earthy, sweet flavor. Add just a little more oil if you like. Salt, pepper, and a little bit of parsley. Stir continuously for about 15 minutes. So after about 15 minutes, this is looking crispy and done. And you can always try a potato, make sure that it's nice and soft and crispy. And now add the cheese. So now I'm gonna let that be for about a couple of minutes. So once the cheese has melted, you wanna flip it. So this is the hard part. <laughs> and now I'll just leave it for another few minutes. You can serve it with sour cream and sprinkle some chives on top, whatever you like. We used to eat it like that, just with our hands. Just break off a piece and... Mm.